Okay guys, let's start. First, we have one pound ground beef. Okay, that's one pound ground beef. So now let's put our three tablespoon of all-purpose all purpose flour. Yes, three tablespoon of all-purpose flour. And three-fourth cup of bread crumbs. Three-fourth cup. And three teaspoon of garlic powder. Three teaspoon of garlic powder. And half a teaspoon of paprika. Half a teaspoon of paprika. And one teaspoon of fen fennel. This is it, guys. Fennel. But don't worry if you don't have this. You can use um, one teaspoon of five spice or one teaspoon of cayenne paper. Pep cayenne pepper. Let's see, one teaspoon of that. And one teaspoon of onion. Oh, actually, guys, this I I'm being lazy to chop real the fresh onion, so I'm gonna use this one tablespoon of this. But you can use one teaspoon of onion powder too. But this one, I love this one, so I'm using it. See? And two teaspoon of salt to taste. This is very easy to make and it's delicious too. See? And then now let's mix, oh no, two eggs. <laughs> Sorry. Two eggs. And now let's mix. Let's mix this really good. So now it's time to make our patty. Yeah, we're gonna shape them into a burger. But before that, let's put oil in our hands so that the meat would not stick to our hands. Guys, this is so easy to make. You just like do that, do that. It's, you can do it. See that? Look how easy it is. Charan! <laughs> And guys, when you make your patty, please do it thinly, not too thick, okay? Mine, I made uh, thinly and thick because I like the thick one, but my husband and Daniel, he likes the thin one. Yeah. So you can make, in one pound, you can make at least 15, 15 patties. Yeah, 15 patties. Form it like a bowl and then press. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Mm. So that's our cooking pan. So let's put a cooking oil spray. Our pan is hot, so let's put our beef patty. We're just gonna fry them. And we're making it sure that both sides are nicely cooked and brown. 
Let's split. So let's check again. Ooh, look at that. It's, they're almost done. We're just gonna fry all our patty like this, okay? See? We're almost done for our first set. So guys, that's our patty. So guys, the way I check my patty, if it's cooked, because I feel like today, I kinda made it like thick, thicker than I, than, I, than I always used to. So I'm gonna cut it here for be able to see if it's the inside is cooked since we're just gonna eat this here in the house see that it's cooked so yep the beef is cooked so oh my goodness it's so good already without even a sauce yet mm. okay i'll tell you guys kevin he smelled this and then he's so excited to eat so he wants to eat this even though without sauce because it's al it's already good so let's put in the plate this is our first batch so let's cook the next batch oops <laughs> guys you can make this like thinner or a little bit thicker it's up to you guys i just want to share it to you kevin he cannot wait to eat our burger patty so he wants to eat right now without a sauce but he will eat with a sauce later but just for now he cannot wait to eat it <laughs> he got so hungry after he smelled it so that's guys that's our last batch in our patty it's nicely done so let's put it in the plate see all of them so now it's time to make our sauce so let's put one tablespoon of olive oil then after that let's put first our flour one fourth cup of flour Mix really good and lower the fire like literally super low. Let's mix this really nice. Next, let's put our two tablespoon of butter. Let's put our half a cup of fresh milk. Do it slowly, okay? Half a cup of fresh milk. Don't pour at once. Just do it slowly. And next are two cups of beef broth. This is like two cups of beef broth. Do it slowly again, okay? Don't pour it all at once. Because we're making our gravy sauce. Guys, when you're making it sure when when you make your gravy sauce, make sure that non-stop of mixing. Yeah. So I just add two cups of um, beef broth and say so just mix we're almost done and then we're just gonna mix this and put our one tablespoon of soy sauce 
we're just gonna mix this guys and then we are going to bring it to sticky like we want our gravy sauce like sticky wow this one it's almost sticky not all the way yet but we're very close just keep mixing it and be patient <laughs> Okay, guys. Let's try the let. Um, let's take let's taste our our gravy if we need to add salt. Okay, I'm just gonna do this thing. Hmm. I wanna add salt, a little bit of salt. So by doing that, you can adjust how much salt you add. Okay, don't don't. Don't put a lot of one time, just control it, control, control, so that we have very yummy sauce. So guys, our sauce is sticky the way I like it. So now it's time to put our mushroom. This is sauce. And then we're just gonna cook this for a minute. By the way guys, before you put, before you use your mushroom from the can, making it sure you rinse it really well. So guys, it's been one minute, so our sauce is done. So let's do a plating. So here's our patty. So let's put our sauce on top. More sauce, more uh, tastes better. Isn't it so beautiful? Guys, I am so excited to eat this even though I already ate two of this without the sauce. And <laughs> Kevin too, he ate one. Because we both cannot wait. See? And I cannot wait. My son will eat this again because it's been a long time. See that, guys? So that's it. We're done. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. Mm. My goodness is so good.